right, so for this exercise, we need the Shorty Practice Training Club, and we're using the bench as our target line. So when you set up, make sure you're setting up with your feet, your knees, your hips, and shoulders square to your target line. You don't want to set up pointing to the right or to the left. All right, so we're going to do a speed progression drill, and the idea is to do the position slowly to make sure you're getting all your positions, and then speed it up to make it more like a regular golf swing and ingrain it into your feeling so that you don't have to think about it when you go play or practice. All right, so set up as if you're going to hit, and the idea is to do super slow motion swings as if someone has videotaped your swing and they're showing it to you in super slow motion. So let's call this speed number one. So we're trying to hit all those positions that we've worked on, impact a square, your extension, and your finish. Good, it's hard to do it slow. Let's do speed number two. So it's not like, unlike speed number one, but we're trying to make each speed a little bit faster. Speed number three can have a little bit of a swish or a little bit of a lag to it. Speed number four might be what your practice swing would be. Nice. Speed number five might be like a pitching wedge. Speed number six might be a short iron. Seven might be what your mid iron is. Eight might be a fairway wood. Nice, we're getting faster. Nine is your regular speed. And 10 is just a little bit faster than you're used to swinging. Great. So when you do that, you're picking up speed, but you're still working on your swing fundamentals. So the idea for this exercise is to progressively make your swing faster so that it feels comfortable and you can keep that speed up so that you can get more power.